I'd like to stay in love with you all summer and after fall. I'd keep you warm through the winter because I've noticed one thing: this ain't no summer fling. I'd like to ride my bicycle. With you on the handlebars, you'd laugh and run away, and I'd chase you through the meadows. Without you, I'd die. Let's never say goodbye. Oh, Lori, you bring the spring. Summer cold, oh, and winter by the season. Oh, Lori, you make me feel so I've been born again. Born again, you dance for me in your bare feet, and so on, boys and girls. <laughs> Well, howdy there, pluckers. I have a sore fingers again with you. A classic song from a pair of brothers called the uh, Alessi Brothers, or Alessi Brothers, whichever way you want to pronounce it, from about 1977, and a song called Oh Laurie. Uh, beautiful chord sequences, a uh, bit jazzy. Uh, might be a bit, uh, bit of a challenge for some of you. Yes, I expect it will. But uh, well worth the effort, I think. Okay, so uh, I mean standard tuning, no capos, doing it in the same key as the original version by the Alessi Brothers. Okay, so um, what you heard there was basically a couple of verses and a chorus, and then basically the song just repeats everything: more choruses, more verses, etc. Yeah, usual thing. Okay, uh, so let's get to it. So uh, it starts off with a uh, on the complete, it goes, I'd like to, and then it goes in with the first chord, and the first chord is a B9. Okay, so what's that? So I'm playing the uh, top three strings on the second fret with a bar using my third finger. Okay, barring the first three strings on the second fret, third finger. This first finger is the first fret of the fourth string. And the second finger is playing the second fret of the fifth string, the A string. Should sound like that. That's a B9, okay? And I'm just going five downwards, okay? I'm not playing the bottom E string. So, and this is the first part of the song is just single strums, okay? There's no rhythm, it's just single strums, okay? So it goes, I'd like to stay in love. Love is a B minor 7, second fret bar, again I'm only playing the first five strings with the bar, and a, a minor shape, pinky off, B minor 7. So I'd like to stay in love with you. That's an A major 7. I'm playing the first fret of the third string G, uh, with my first finger, second fret of the fourth string with my second finger and the second fret of the third, uh, second string with my third finger okay it's like a d7 shape but upper string if you like okay and i'm playing five down to one okay so that's the first uh, three chords okay so we'll go through that again i'd like to stay in love with you be a choice here there's there's a quick change or you can miss out the quick change okay all summer is two chords really it's all summer so all is C sharp minor seventh that's the sort of B minor seventh shape up two frets so I'm playing the four fret bar first five strings again minor shape pinky off five down to one okay and then an F sharp minor seventh bar in the second fret all the way with the first finger and the fourth fret of the third, uh, sorry, fourth fret of the fifth string, the A string with the third finger. Okay, so now we've got that. So it's I'd like to stay in love 
with you all summer. Okay, now if you find that a bit of a rush, miss out the C sharp minor seventh and just go to the F sharp minor seventh like this. Like to stay in love with you all summer. Okay, you can miss out the change C sharp minor if you don't want to. If you can't do it or you not comfortable with it, miss that out, just go straight to the F sharp minor seventh, okay? But ideally, try and get that one in if you can. So once again, as I played it, I'd like to stay in love with you all summer. And after, back to the B9, for B minor seventh, I'd keep you. Notice where it changes. This is uh, like a G, like an F shape on the third, third fret. So an F shape on fret three, okay, with an open A string, o fifth string open. Don't play the bottom E string, just the A string open downwards. Okay, now the fancy name for this is A7 sus2 sus4, okay, okay. Some people would call that G with A in the bass, but apparently the proper name is A7 sus2 sus4. So now we've got that. So it's the second line where it goes, uh, let's go from the beginning. I'd like to stay in love with you all summer and after fall I'd keep you warm through the winter is an A7. That's <laughs> something simple. <laughs> That's an A chord with an open third string. Second on the fourth and second on the second. Five down to one, open A string. Okay, let's just go through up to that point. We're almost there. <laughs> okay, I'd like to stay in love with you all summer after four. Keep you warm through the winter. Okay, now we go to a nice, fairly simple one, a D major seven. That's just barring the first three strings on the second fret with your first finger. Okay, barring the first three strings with your first finger, second fret, five down to one, open fifth string, open fourth string, five down to one, D major seven. Okay, so it comes into that uh, winter. D major 7th, because I've noticed one thing, another fairly simple one, E minor 7, second, first finger, second fret, or whichever finger is more comfortable for you, but I'm using my first finger on the second fret of the fifth string, and my third finger on the third fret of the second string. Five down to one again. Okay, so that's because I've noticed one thing, that's that E minor 7th, one more chord to go, that A major 7th again, this A, A no summer fling, okay, got that, that's the last chord on this, on the verse, A major 7th, which we played earlier in the verse, okay, so all the way from the beginning, okay, here we go then, <clears throat> I'd like to stay in love with you all summer and after fall I'd keep you warm through the winter because I've noticed one thing this ain't no summer thing okay then there's a bit of drum and then it goes quick E uh, quick D to E nice quick D E and then a nice little bit here. I'm barring the first five strings with my first finger on the seventh fret. Leave the bottom E string open and you go. Right? Bom chin, bom chin, bom chin. Okay? Sort of thing. That's uh, D with E in the bass if you want to know. Okay? So, once again, very slowly. I'd like to be nice. B minor seventh, A minus A major seventh. 
C sharp minor seven, F sharp minor seven, uh, B ninth, uh, B minor seven. Da, da, da. This uh, A seven sus two sus four, A seven, D major seventh, da, 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 E minor seventh, da, da, da. A major seventh, da, 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 da. D to E, D with E in the bass. Just all going through it as it's uh, singing it as well, probably. Okay, so I'd like to stay in love with you all summer, and after fall, I'd keep you warm through the winter. Because I know it's one thing, this ain't no summer. the verse okay now the rest of the song is played uh, strumming right rather than single chords and it's exactly the same chords for the next verse but it's strum in jazz style like a chunk 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 okay so that comes in when it goes ain't, ain't no summer thing no sorry I'd like to ride my bike Cool. It's like four chunks on each chord, yeah? I'd like to ride my bicycle with you on the handlebars you'd left and ran away and I'd chase you through the meadows without you I'd die let's never say goodbye Exactly the same as when you did the single chords on the first verse, but it's like chunk, chunk, chunk all the time. Same chord sequence, okay? Once again, I like to ride my bicycle with you on the handlebars you'd left and run away, and I'd chase you through the meadows without you. I'd Let's never say goodbye. Exactly the same, but different sort of rhythm. Okay, so that's the first two verses. Then the only thing left is the chorus. Okay, so after you've done that, bit of a pause, and then we go to Oh, Lori. Right now, it's a little bit, uh, a bit more tricky. So we start on a B minor seventh this time. Oh, Lori. Right, two options on this one. Okay, so B minor seventh. Oh, again, it's the chunk, chunk, chunk four times, yeah? Oh, Lori. And what playing this is B diminished seven. Okay, okay, so the way I'm playing it is one version. I'll show you another version as well. Okay, so. This is, uh, let's start with the uh, first finger. First finger is playing the first fret of the third string. Second finger is playing the second fret of the fifth string. Third finger is playing the third fret of the fourth string, the D string. And pinky is playing the uh, third fret of the second string, the B string. I'm resting my thumb very lightly on the bottom E string, muting that bottom string, okay? And I'm just going, trying not to hit the top E string. So trying to aim at five down to two. So, so it goes, uh, oh, Lori. Okay, now the, op the option on this, that's B diminished seven is to play this that okay so this is first fingers playing the um, third fret of the fourth string the D string second fingers playing the third fret of the second third fingers playing the fourth fret of the third string and uh, pinky is playing the fourth fret of the top E string 
four down to one. I'm not playing the fifth string and I'm not playing the sixth string. Okay, and that's and that's but that's so it goes. Uh, So you've got two choices there. You've got that one, four strums on that, downward strokes on that, or this one. Just a sort of lower register, yeah? So it goes, oh, Lori. Or you can go, oh, Lori. Okay, got that. Uh, so there we go. So, oh, Lori. Right, and the next next bit is is two chords. It's F sharp minor seven. That's one you've played earlier in the intro. Barring the second fret, all the way across, have first finger and the fourth fret of the fifth string with your third finger. And this this all uh, alternates between F sharp uh, minor seven. Two two strokes on each, really. Right goes, it goes, oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. oh Lori, you bring the spring and summer fall, fall and winter by the season. Oh, right, so what are you doing there? So it's four strokes on the B minor seventh. Oh, and the diminish, whichever one you're going to do, Lori. And then we're doing two strokes on F sharp minor seventh, and then two show, uh, two two uh, strokes down strokes on a C sharp seventh or a D flat seventh, whichever one you want to call it. Okay, which is uh, if you imagine a C chord, and you put your pinky on the third fret of the third string, the G string, you get a C seven. Yeah. Well, if you move that up one, all all fingers up one fret, hold the shape. Move all up one fret. So this is on the second fret, first finger on the second fret of the second string. Second finger is on the third fret of the fourth string. Third finger is on the fourth fret of the fifth string and pinky is on fourth fret of the third string. Again, I'm just resting my thumb on the bottom E string so I don't sound it. This first finger will lean over and kill the top E string automatically. You won't really have to do much about it, do it on its own hold that shape and that normally happens okay but mute the bottom E string so you've got one two one two one so it goes so I do it slowly oh glory you bring the spring the summer fall ooh, and winter okay and on that last F sharp minor seventh there's four okay so it goes, you bring the spring, the summer fall, ooh, and winter by the season. Oh, glory. Back again to the beginning bit again, the B minor seventh to the um, B uh, diminished seven. Four beats on each, okay? So let's get that so far. So it goes, uh, play it slowly. Bring the spring, the summer fall, who and winter by the season. Oh, glory. Okay, so as far as we got, yeah. Now the next one is, it's different. It's like what you do there is second one, oh, glory is, oh, glory. You make me feel so I've been born again. Born again. Okay, so that, that after the second O Lori, you do what I do there is a lazy A, and this is like two two strokes on each chord now. So lazy A, barring the second fret of the fourth, third, and second strings, and the open fifth string. Two hits on that one. Two hits on that C sharp seventh that you just played earlier with the F sharp minor seventh. Okay, so back to that one for two hits. So it's A, 
two, two hits on the lazy A, two hits on a C sharp seventh, and then we play a, um, a, a G, a G diminished seven, uh, like the one you, the one I showed you here, which was a B uh, diminished seven. It's one fret down. Okay, this has got various names. You can call it a G diminished seven. You could call it a B flat diminished seven. Okay, so I'm playing the second fret of the fourth string with the first finger, second fret of the second string with my second finger, third fret of the third string with my third finger, and third fret of the top E string with my pinky. Again, it's only four down to one, and that's four beats. Okay, so it's A, C sharp seventh two. And then four on this uh, uh, G or G or B flat diminished seven, and I'm loving you is B minor seventh loving you, and then this one this D with A E in the bass again. Okay, and that's the chorus. So I'll try and go through the whole thing very slowly. So coming out of the second verse. Oh Lori, you bring the spring the summer fall who and winter by the season Oh Lori, you make me feel as though I've been born again Born again Okay, once more very slowly, I'm trying to slow it down even more Uh, still, I guess, so I've got a wrong I ran, went, jumped a line. Sorry again, sorry. Second verse. Bird, the chorus come in. Oh, Lord, you bring the spring, the summer fall, who and winter by the season. Oh, Lord, you make me feel as though. I've been born again, born again. You dance for me. Back to normal again. Verse, normal verse, yeah. You dance for me in your bed feet. And so on. You get the idea, don't you? Well, hopefully, you've got that. <laughs> <laughs> Bit of a challenge, I expect, for some people, okay? Uh, it's not easy, but uh, it's clearly logical, and uh, you know, a lot of it is repeating, so uh, a lot of the chords are the same in the chorus as in the verse, okay? So, um, a project, okay? Thanks very much for watching and listening, hope you enjoyed that one. Uh, something a little different, and I'll see you in the next lesson. Bye for now. <laughs>